Because it, it ended up being John Goodman crashed this girl, abducted her, and then took on his stupid little hand who helped him fill, or helped him build the fallout shelter. So like that's how they all got there. And he's creepy, and he had a big, huge 55-gallon tub of perchloric acid, which is the shit that devours entire bodies if you put people inside of it. And he killed the guy. This game isn't starting for me. And it looked you gotta think, think hard, hard. Oh, it felt like it's going. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> You've never heard it. No. Uh, it's just the fucking preschool shit. But... No. <laughs> You've never, you never heard. The... Think, think hard, hard. Double, double, retard. <laughs> oh, you got That's the fucking stupid. You just got the That's fuck fucking out of me. Stupid. I fell for it. <laughs> I would much rather do that. I would just. I would much rather buy a house, stop moving. See, I can't. I can't settle down. I gotta. Gotta stay on the move. Why? Because the government might catch you. They will. Like, mm. If I stay in one place too long, they'll find me. You might be a psycho. So what do you do once you've? Achieved a level 30. You hang out, relax. You That's beg cool. to the almighty division gods to grant you good gear. <laughs> That's what you do. You sacrifice <laughs> a lamb every Sunday <laughs> at 3 p.m. I hope that you get some fucking gold or yellow gear. Sounds like your typical MMO. You're like, oh, fuck. <laughs> no more, no more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack. What's new? Huh. On second thought, never mind. You are a horrible person. Whoa. What's this girl's problem? I'm running down the street my own business. She's like, what's new? Never mind, you're a horrible person. She ran she away. She has everybody's problem in this game. She has to toxic shock syndrome. Septic shock from not changing her tampon. That's what I'm saying. Toxic shock. <laughs> Okay, I got you. You know what I learned today? What's that? That it really sucks a bag of fucking dicks when you wake up in the morning and you step in water. Were you wearing <laughs> socks? Or did you piss on no, the floor I wasn't. and forget about it? I didn't piss on the floor. My fucking water heater fucked up. Oh, okay. That sucks too. That's a fucking treasure chest. You better have some booty in there. <laughs> oh, I got booty. It needs to be in there, though. Well, yeah, Josh, I, uh, my, the FBI had to go do a uh, background investigation on me oh my God. to make sure that What's I was worthy of a... Uh... <laughs> it was for a reason, to make oh, sure yeah. I was worthy so, of my so fucking... So it's legit, not My security good. clearance. Yeah. Yeah, my security clearance in the Army. They had to double check. So when they went and double checked, they went and talked to my neighbor. And they asked him about, like, you know, any incidences that I may have had or that they'd heard about or anything like that. And my neighbor brought up the time that I was playing Street Fighter uh, Street Fighter 2 Turbo. <laughs> And I played it on seven stars difficulty, and I took the controller out and fucking destroyed it right in fucking front of him. Yeah. And then there's, I mean, a, I there's a note in your file that says, "Don't let him play video games in public." I'm sure. <laughs> yeah, I stood up real quiet, calm, like unplugged the controller from my fucking 360. Mm -hmm. Took it outside, swung it around my head like a fucking. Aim. I don't know, like a lasso, <laughs> fucking slammed it in the fucking ground and started screaming at it. That's what you get, motherfucker! Oh, man. When I tell you to do something, you fucking do it! I, <laughs> like I'm fucking losing my mind. I fisted two uh, Segas into the ground after losing at the original and the you second Mortal Kombat. I was like, oh my god. Because <laughs> for the longest time, I could never beat Kentaro. In, in the first one, in the second one. And then, uh... Dude, the, f oh. the first fucking Mortal Kombat is hard, dude. Yeah, it dude, Goro really was a hard. bitch. 
And me being, what, eight years old or something? I don't know how to fucking play anyway. Just pissed me off. Smooch, Kintaro is the reason why I have the, the jump trip uh, moveset in my fucking, in my technical abilities whenever I play a fighter. Active echo yeah. detected. Yeah. She's an asshole. Kintaro specifically. That's, yeah. Yeah. Goro's the reason why I fucking jump a lot because in Mortal Kombat, Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3, that's how you beat him. You'd fucking combo, 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 jump, and then do it's the same thing on the other side order, and just jump son. back and forth. Wait a second. A fucking... Kintaro was the tiger forearm guy in 2, right? Yeah. 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 Oh my god. I think I've beat him like 10 times ever. And then I just stopped playing the game. So. No, now he works at Napkin Studios. <laughs> Napkin. No, they changed it. They changed it. It's uh, it's squirrels or something now. And they make they make business presentation software. So, if they have like a, a PowerPoint display that they're showing on a projector, they can also stream it stream it to their phones and tablets. So it's like you know, cutting edge. <laughs> You don't have to do that again if you don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> You're a fucking idiot. <laughs> hey, you know, they Cutting live off. Edge. They live off that idea, so you can't really knock it, can you? <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> you might be fucking dumb. <laughs> I might be a condescending douchebag. I don't know about dumb. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I felt like I was in a commercial there for a minute. <laughs> One of those cheesy, like, Channel 2 commercials at 3 in the morning. <laughs> channel 2. I forgot about Channel 2. You can't forget about Channel 2. There's some good shit on there. Sure you're not thinking about Channel 1 news, Tim? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm thinking about <laughs> no, I'm thinking about Channel 2. Do miss Channel 1 news, though. No, because I was, we had like normal cable, we didn't have like satellite or anything like that <clears throat> growing up and every time I, I get really fucking confused as to why 3 was the lowest channel and then I'd click on 2 because it wasn't a part of the actual program menu, <laughs> but you could just click 2 and it would go to it. <clears throat> but when it went to it, it's like all fucking like ads and shit, like what the fuck is this? <laughs> like the guide channel and stuff, like what the fuck? I didn't even know this thing existed. It's like the land of misfit toys for television. <laughs> indicate an echo nearby. Why are you scared of the fucking dog? Alright, this dog will live forever, I guess. I don't know. I froze him in time. That's pretty cool. Oh my god, that's a horrible fucking name. Josephine. Or Josephine. Either Dude. of those. You're stupid. You cannot. You just want to name your kid Joe. You can't. In that case, just name your kid Joe. You can't socialize with people called that. Josephine, Co like Colleen, no. Oh, Colleen, it's so bad, dude. I could, I could meet the most ideal female in the world. If her name's Colleen. She's dead to me. Not even gonna give it <laughs> a chance. Like you need to do some documentation and fix that shit, because it's not gonna happen. Or, or we're done before we started, bitch. Pretty much. <laughs> Pretty much. Colleen to me is the kind of girl that has the haircut that says. My kids, or I'm white, but my kids aren't. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like I, she smokes menthols. I, I don't know what that means, haircut-wise. I know the type of person, but they all look a little bit different in my experience. Like, uh, like a bob type haircut. Okay. Oh. Which sucks, because I, yeah. I like that, that short hair type, but basically just chasing after the BBC and only finding fucking just RBC, regular, <laughs> black cocks. <laughs> you you can't chase the BBC. It comes to you. Well, the BBC is one of the fucking foremost like news reporting stations on the fucking planet. It just happens to be the <laughs> oh turn around. <laughs> Cutting edge. <laughs> <laughs> you both are assholes. <laughs> I have a bright <laughs> career in shitty advertising. I know it. I can't believe you said that shit like so spot on, like cutting edge. 
Like, okay, I'm sorry, let me buy your I fucking picture, product. I picture two 80s people going by in rollerblades, like, <laughs> edge. <laughs> you guys ever seen that commercial, like, what the internet is? Like, what's the internet? Set. We're riding on the internet. Cyberspace set free. Hello, virtual reality. Interactive appetite. Searching for a website. A window to the world. Got to get online. Take a spin. Now you're in with the techno set. You're going surfing on the internet. That's what I'm picturing right there. They're all wearing like shitty ski jackets and shit because it's like the winter, but it sucked. It's a dick. Oh, it's so bad. You could check your email. <laughs> that stands for electronic mail. Oh, God, shut up. The, the fact that you can report this calls into question a lot of things for me.